DJ ATV. DJ ATV. IPOB Sack Simon Ekba as Radio Biafra Broadcaster plus Emma of Taraba gives Edas 30 days ultimatum to vacate the forest. Hi guys, good morning to you, good afternoon to you, and good evening to you, depending on the location you're watching us from. A very big welcome to you. This is DJ MTV Daily News Update, the WhatsApp channel for the latest and the best news all around the world. If this is your first time of seeing any of our video, do take a step further, subscribe and turn on the notification bell so that you can be the first to get notified each time we post a new video. Let's go straight up into the main news. The indigenous people of Biafra, IPOB, on Wednesday explained why Simon Ekba may no longer continue as a broadcaster on Radio Biafra. IPOB disclosed that Simon has refused to follow laid down rules and regulations of operation in Radio Biafra. Hence, the need to discontinue with his services. Simon was engaged as one of the broadcasters on Radio Biafra shortly after the re-arrest of Mazi Nabdikanu, the leader of the indigenous people of Biafra. However, the group said Simon's service may no longer be needed because he has refused to sign the rules of engagement and code of conduct guiding those broadcasting on Radio Biafra. The global family of the indigenous people of Biafra, IPOB, ably led by our great leader, Mazi Nabdikanu, has observed with regret that Mazi Simon, who our leader, Mazi Nabdikanu, gave an appointment and duty to start broadcasting on Radio Biafra, doesn't want to follow the laid down rules of oppression in Biafra and radio. Our leader, Mazi Unamdikanu, gave the directive why in detention, but Mazi Simon has refused to follow the principles. Mazi Simon Ekpa has refused to sign the rules of engagement and code of conduct guiding those procrastinating on Radio Biafra. We don't understand why Mazi Simon would not like to follow the step of other broadcasters on the platform who have since done the needful. Indigenous people of Biafra is a big movement and cannot just change the rules because of one individual. As this may set a bad precedent, Mazi Simon Ekpa is a hard-working Biafra whose immense contribution towards the restoration of Biafra are highly appreciated. But for not signing the code of conduct as a broadcaster on Radio Biafra, he may not continue to have the opportunity of broadcasting via the platform. This decision was not intended to ridicule or undermine anyone, but to prove to all that due process cannot be compromised in indigenous people of Biafra, IPOB. IPOB is a well structured movement where activities of members are regulated with well thought out rules. No one should act in a way that suggests that the laws are meant for certain group of people. Why Mazi Simon Ekba has the right to make his broadcast on Facebook and on other platforms of his choice, he may no longer broadcast on Radio Biafra as one of the official broadcasters. Meanwhile, the Emir of Muri Empire in Taraba State, Abbas Saifidas, has issued a 30 days ultimatum to aid us terrorizing residents of the state to vacate every forest within the state or be forced to do so. The Emir gave the ultimatum after the Eid's prayer. This followed a rising spate of kidnapping, killings, and attack in the state by criminals suspected to be elders. He claimed that the Fulani elders are responsible for perpetrating crimes in the state and should therefore vacate forests in the state within 30 days or be forced out. Let's watch the video. Pull on him, Muburu, on the dodge. 
kuzo wa kasana kuyanwa muni muye da kuyanwa muni mumu kumara ba to na son da mayeku mu kan musulmi ne ko kuma da kuka so yanwa mu musulmi ne ko kuma musulmai ba dole ku ba da wannan amsa daya in ku musulmai ne to ku zauna daji ku zo kuna daukan mu daya daya sai mun ba da kudi ku daina don wannan Allah bai yadda da shi ba in kuma ku ba musulma ne musulmai ba ne ku gaya mana mun yi fada da kafiran da za mu yi da na yanzu Assalamu <laughs> There are a lot of uh, progress, and uh, also uh, Mr. President is, uh, is, 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 is is on it, and uh, and I believe uh, we are going to succeed at the end of the day. I also want to uh, urge Nigerian to also stay behind the president and support him for the fight against. The Emir, who spoke in also language, urged the leadership of Fulani Etsme to fish out the bad eggs among them. Our Fulani herdsmen in the forest, you came into this state and we accepted you. Why then will you be coming to town and villages to kidnap residents, even up to the extent of raping our women? Because of this unending menace, every Fulani herdsman in this state have been given 30 days ultimatum to vacate the forest. We are tired of having sleepless nights and the hunger alone in the land is enormous and we will not allow it to continue, the Emir said. Taraba State, located in the northeast um, region of Nigeria, is faced with heinous crime ranging from kidnapping to bandit attack. So guys, here you have it, um, the indigenous people of Biafra, um, IPOB, has um, come out to say that Mazi um, Simon Ekba, the disciple of Mazun Abdikanu that was recently recently asked to start broadcasting um, after the re-arrest of Mazi Unabdikanu. According to the indigenous people of Biafra, he has refused to sign the code of conduct of um, Radio Biafra. So hence the need um, for him to sign or discontinue with his service as a broadcaster in Radio Biafra. According to the group, they appreciated Simon's service. Uh, he has been a broadcaster since the rearrest of Mazen and the Canada. He has been doing well, but his service may no longer be needed because he has refused to sign the rules of engagement and code of conduct guiding those broadcasting on the radio Biafra. Also, we saw the Emir of Taraba State um, giving the Fulani X-Men 30 days ultimatum 
to vacate every forest in the state. And this is as a result of the rising spot of kidnappings, killing and attack in the state by these criminals suspected to be Fulani S-men. Of course, this is not the first time that the Fulani S-men are attacking innocent people, killing the people, raping their women, and um, these Fulani S-men have not stopped. In fact, it was reported that they have uh, made the residents of the state, some of them vacated their houses, their villages, just to be safe. But Emir uh, of Taraba State, who spoke in Aousa, has urged the Fulani Esmen to fish out the bad egg among them in order not to uh, spoil the name of the old Fulani men. Many Nigerians have expected um, this action from not just um, um, Emir of Taraba State, but from all governors of the whole state in um, Nigeria, uh, asking all the Fulani to vacate their state and go back to where they are coming from. Instead of coming to kill their, their people, rape their women, kidnapping and um, all sorts of crime. We would like to hear from you about what you think about the action of the Emir of Taraba State um, over the 30 days ultimatum given to the Fulani estimate to vacate the forest. And also, on the case of um, Simon Ipa, that is to discontinue broadcasting in the Radio Biafra, for his refusal to sign the code of conduct of radio biafra drop your comment in the comment section below and please do not forget to like share and comment on all our videos please follow us on all our social media platforms on facebook on youtube and on instagram also check us out on our website www.djmtv.news i am victor obrichi reporting for djmtv news DJ and TV. DJ and TV.